Hey YouTube, so today is Friday, uh, about 11.30 in the morning, uh, Wednesday afternoon, about 6, 7 p.m. We got hit by a pretty nasty storm. Um, most of my hometown is still on generators yet. Um, a couple businesses just got their power back on the south side of town. Uh, so I'm optimistic for this afternoon, but uh, just, a, just a half a mile south of town out here, um, is my dad's property my dad's barn and we he wasn't so lucky lost the barn luckily enough we don't have any animal or i can't say we because i just help him out it's his his he don't have any animals so the only thing that we or he lost is the barn itself gravity boxes might have a couple little damage done to them and whatever hay and straw is up there uh, the only damage you know and obviously it had a steel roof on it that went that way that's in the barn there I'll go over there in a second but that partially landed on the sprayer only damage to the sprayer I mean it might actually still might be total this whole boom is just warped warped the crap so that's junk and blew all those trees over but there was a yard there's a yard right over there that's missing 90% of the trees. I mean, you can't tell it right now by looking, because you can see trees all right there, but trust me, if I go over there, yeah, it's, we had no confirmed tornado yet, but definitely 114 mile per hour straight winds for sure were recorded. And I know my buddy right down the street here, uh, his parents lost the machine shed. And there's a guy right down the street here that lost the machine shed too, but I'll get them. But let me go over here and show you the. Yeah. I know my brother in law, he's going to come down and grab some of the steel, I guess. So I might start, I might go get an impact driver, start taking screws out for that, but. Yeah, about bad timing. Just about ready to do hay. Luckily enough, he had most of the stuff parked in here. Cables. Sprayer was hanging out right about here and a lot of this stuff, this beam fell on that sprayer. That was sticking out of the shed here. Other than that, that was it. So very, very minor when it comes to equipment damage, but the barn is totaled. And that is the reason that I canceled my trip for this weekend. I was gonna go up north and with the camper, do a nice camping trip. But uh, next weekend I got another trip, so let's keep our fingers crossed. We got hot and humid weather coming this week too, and every any time in Wisconsin you get hot and humid weather, it usually means a bad storm. So oh, let's see what happens. Yeah, this guy right here, I think lost <laughs> half his trees. Store made it pretty good. All them pine trees got cut up. These guys are giving her heck today. Power lines down. And then my dad's barn that blew down is, is right there. It all just headed straight that way. Yeah. Can't stop Mother Nature. <laughs> 